why I left my job as a doctor in Canada and came to Nigeria to contest for a political position. Omar D. Welcome to the news and thank you for tuning in to listen. Chida Doma directed to BBC News why he decided to leave his job as a medical doctor in Canada to come to Nigeria to contest for a political position in Anambra State. In his words, he said, I'm a medical doctor who works in Canada. When I left my job, I made up my mind to contest for a political position in Anambra State. Umadi said he saw how the country is going on a negative direction. Nothing is working well in Nigeria. So he had to make up his mind to contribute to the development of Nigeria. He said, and I quote, I could not sit and watch Nigeria head towards the wrong direction. I had to do something about it. I had to contest on a position that will make me contribute to the welfare of a country. I had to do something about uplifting the country in any position I contest on. He said that leadership of a country is not going well, but at the same time, he said that leadership is not an easy job. But Nigerian leadership are not doing the leadership work well, Omadi said. And this is what I'm talking about, vision. This is what I'm talking about, vision. People who are doctors, they'll tell you, ah, I became a doctor because, oh, when I was little, oh, my, my father suffered a cardiac arrest and there was nobody to help him and he almost died or maybe he even died. And maybe now I don't want a repeat of that. So I, you know, there's always a vision. But though he did not really, I'm, I know this, he's going to speak more on this. This is not all about what he said. They only took, they only took a few lines. But the thing is, this is what we are talking about, Sha. And this is what I want. Somebody will come from God, as in from a common family. From a common, a commoner from a common family will come in, see that things are not going well. Observe that things are not going well. You know? Looks for solution, gets the solution, come in, asks for votes. People vote for him because he's with the solution. He distributes the solution and voila. You know, Nigeria starts getting better, at least in those particular areas. All right. And you think you can single-handedly change Nigeria for the better overnight, starting from Manambra State? You came to Nigeria for, re for reasons, forgetting that there are players in the field. If you can't beat them, you join them, no matter your effort. They will frustrate you to the extent that you are asking yourself who sent you. Probably you are not doing well in your career. That is why you left a medical job abroad for Nigeria politics. See, people don't understand. Would I like you to know that joining people out there? Yes. My dear, like I said, this is a more thing like I have a vision. This is it. Because a medical doctor in abroad, I'm on the pay is very much what you know. I'm not gonna lie. Leaving that, I'm th I'm I'm sure he's going to be taking more of his courage. But I think, yes, whether you like it or not, he's going to be able to make a change. This is the same thing I tell Nigerians, all of us, we in one capacity or the other, we are actually part of a problem here. And we are going to be part of a solution if we want to. Do you understand? So, I don't see any problem here. I don't see any problem at all. He's not doing well and he's contesting a senatorial election in Anambra. My friend, you're not very smart. It is actually wrong for you to say he's not doing well. Okay, you better go back to your job in Canada before you lose it. Politicians do not leave office with good names in Nigeria. Maybe he's going to be a first. By the time you finish your term of office, people will be using all manners of native charms to cost you and your family. <laughs> Your reputation will be gone and nobody will respect you again. You can ask the former retired politicians in Nigeria. Stay on your job as a medical doctor and face your career. Well, life is all about taking risk and he took it. My own is at the end of the day, let him look well, Sha. Very, very important. All right, and this note, we have come to the end of the news. We say thank you for turning in to listen. Until I come your way next time, enjoy. Enjoy the rest of your day.